What does a cure look like? What is disease? Are we destroying the very thing that can save us? If you think your medicine merely comes from a drugstore, think again. Your drugs very well might have originated from a natural source, in a plant, or on tree bark, or from a frog. Nature has been curing disease as long as man has been alive. Welcome to planet Earth. A world rich with biological diversity, where forms of medicine grow quietly by our side. Promises of hope can be gleaned today, right now, from cultures different and unknown. At the crossroads between modern medicine and the ancient medical traditions of indigenous cultures is Amy Greeson, healing seeker. As a classically trained pharmacist, she understands the science of healing, drugs' origins, and effects. As a woman of discovery, she seeks out healing traditions around the globe, searching for new plants with promising healing futures. Healing Seekers. Adventure with a purpose. I'm Amy Greeson, and our Healing Seekers team is here in Madagascar. This is a place that I've always wanted to come, and one of the main reasons is this land holds the original source of the rosy periwinkle, and that's where we've gotten two of our most powerful chemo drugs. The natives used the rosy periwinkle to treat omiyada, which means killing little by little. We would call that cancer. This area is so isolated from the rest of the world. Its flora and fauna have developed independently and have evolved into thousands of species of plants and animals that are found nowhere else in the world. He said uh, what he knows, uh, he comes mainly from his grandfather and uh, his father. Because as he said, he, he doesn't trust other people. Oh, yeah. Okay. Um, getting ready to uh, go see an OBS, and he has got uh, some people waiting here, so we've got to sort of take our turn. But um, apparently, this guy works through spirits or a tromba, and he also heals with plants. So, this is going to be a unique guy to see. It is written on his chest, the point. That means that the energy comes from the inside, so everything is inside. Ah, like mm -hmm. the spirit, mm -hmm. the, the soul. Mm -hmm. And it can protect you. Nice. Mm -hmm. Over 60% of the plants that have been cataloged here actually have healing properties. But when you put it in perspective, one half of 1% of all the world's flowering species has been discovered. So this is really still largely unexplored. Heart medicines from a plant, anesthesia from a frog, cancer treatments, from a way of life that is systematically being destroyed at the rate of one mile per minute, every hour, every day. Mm. Uh, it's time to rethink medicine, expand our perceptions of healing, expand our perceptions of ourselves. It is possible that your grandchildren can know a world without cancer, without diabetes, with cures springing up from the ground. Expose yourself to a planet of possibilities. With your financial support, the work of the Healing Seekers will continue to make a difference, now and for generations to come. Sometimes finding a cure takes you off the beaten path, only to put you back on one. I believe that there are cures for our most devastating diseases. I believe that there are cures for cancer. And I believe that we will find them. We are the healing seekers. The Healing Seekers.